Chari. Ryan Chari, the 28-year-old. Uh, Bowled him straight through. Exocet from Shaheen Sharafridi. And Chari's gone. Deadly with the new ball. Ball darting back into the right-hander. And as so often, with the new ball, he attacks the stumps. The angle of the left arm is so difficult when the ball swinging back in. But when he makes it, that it hits the middle stump, you've got no chance whatsoever. Shine Chafridi strikes with the new ball. Chari out for two. It's two for one. Oh, yes! The death rattle again from Shaheen. That's the way you do it. You don't clip the bales. You hit the stumps. The inside edge right onto the middle stump. And Shaheen Shafridi with yet another bowl. He just carries on in white ball cricket with hitting the stumps. This time a little bit of help from the batsman. A big inside edge. But played on or clean bowl doesn't matter still wickets with the new ball for Shaheen Shah Freedy. gone for 13 and it's 28 for 2 Zimbabwe if he's getting the ball to tweak okay. yeah. and done so partnership has been broken Imad Basim you can bet your bottom dollar that he'll bail you out of a tough situation Harris Rao took the catch well, just as we're talking about uh, the importance of these two carrying on as long as they can in the Zimbabwean in innings, Craig Irvin, it's a shot that he plays well and uh, quite often gets that either over that man or past him to the boundary for four. However, it wasn't to be this time. Craig Irvin stuck around for a while, Brendan Taylor, good knock of 42, Zimbabwe now 99 for three. Good delivery, fabulous delivery. It's the Jaffa really was quick and a wonderful delivery to get rid of the left hander. Wasn't feeling comfortable against Wahab's short pitch stuff, back of the length, and it had a telling effect on the batsman, just drawing away from the line of the ball and nicely held by the keeper. Yeah, Sean Williams. Looked a bit out of sorts to uh, Wahab Riaz. He goes for four. Zimbabwe now four down for 150. You'd expect short man like that, bouncy wicket. He would struggle with that. They've uh, seen that he can play that shot. And they've set people back for him. Deep and wicket on the boundary. Bowled him, knocked him over. Madaveri looking leg side, and it was straight and full from Wahab Riaz. And that's the end of a wonderful little innings from the youngster Wesley Madaveri. And this crucial partnership has been broken. Yeah, the pressure just got a little too much for uh, the young man. Looked to force the ball before, couldn't get it away. Looked to force that one. And Wahab Riaz, you miss, I hit. It's been a really, really good knock. Supported Brendan Taylor well. 55 from 61 for Wesley Madevere. 234 for 5. Brendan Taylor, he's looked to go up and over the man who's in the circle at mid-off. It's gone straight up and taken by Wahab Riaz. Brendan Taylor perishes as he tries to steer Zimbabwe home and he gets congratulations from the Pakistan players. The spirit of cricket is alive here in Rawalpindi. 
Rice has gone a mile high. And Wahab, that's one he didn't want to drop. Brilliant innings from Brendan Taylor. It comes to an end, 112. It's 240 for six. Off stump goes, Raza perishes, Wahab Riaz is deadly at the death and he is so difficult to get away. And Zimbabwe's hopes are fading very quickly here. We talked about Wahab Riaz being the man who can come back for Pakistan at the back end of the innings and take wickets. And that's exactly what he's doing. And that's his third, Wahab Riaz. And uh, Sikandar Raza perishes. He gets eight. Zimbabwe now 245 for seven. Two forty-five for seven. Zimbabwe tries to loft him over mid-off, and he finds Wahab Riaz yet again. And uh, Shaheen Afridi picks up his fourth wicket of the night. Well, you can't keep Wahab away from the wickets if he's not bowling the Zimbabwean batsmen out. He's catching them at mid-off. Well judged in the end by uh, Wahab Riaz. Sees the end of Karl Mumba just for the one. Zimbabwe, 2.46 for eight. Shaheen asking for a change in field. Fine leg going a lot finer than he was. Ten yards to his left. Bullseye, a fifth wicket for Shaheen Sharafridi. He is unerringly accurate with that Yorker. He's one of the best in the business. Back to back, five wicket hauls for this tall, talented left arm quick from Pakistan. That's yeah, been uh, a wonderful performance of the ball from Shaheen. And that is a wonderful Yorker. Crashed into the off stump before Chisoro could even think of getting his back down in time. Gives thanks to almighty Allah for yet another five wicket haul. Zimbabwe's ninth ball. Tendai Chisoro goes for five, 250 for nine. Like that. Wahab Riaz finishes things off with his fourth wicket. And Zimbabwe are bowled out with two balls to go. Zimbabwe 255 all out. Pakistan have won by 26 runs. And nine wickets shared between Wahab Riaz with four and Shaheen Sharafridi with five. 